Shir Hashirim, Song of Solomon, 4. Behold, you lovely shepherdess. Behold, you are fair. You have the lovely eyes of doves, which are seen through your face veil. Your hair glistens like a flock of goats as they glisten from Mount Gilad. Your teeth are like a drove of those being fashioned from the washing, all of which have twins and none of which are bereaved. Your lips are like a thread of double-dipped scarlet and your speech is comely. Your temples are like a piece of pomegranate that can be seen through your veil. Your neck is like the Tower of David built for an armory, thousand of buckles and the shields of the masterful men. Rather, thousand of buckles and the shields of the masterful men. Your two breasts are like two fawns, the twins of a gazelle, which graze among the lilies. Until the day blows in and the shadows flee away, I shall go to the mountain of myrrh and to the hill of frankincense. All of you is a lovely shepherdess. And there is no blemish in you. Come with me from Lebanon, my bride. From Lebanon you shall come. You shall see from the top of Amana, from the top of Shir, rather, Shenir and Kherman, from the lion's dens, from the mountains of the leopards. You stir my heart, my sister, my bride. You stir my heart with one of your eyes, with one necklace on your neck. Your affections are lovely, my sister, my bride. How much better is your affections than wine and the smell of your ointments than all spices? Your lips, my bride, drip with honey. Honey and milk are under your tongue. And the scent of your garments is like the scent of Lebanon. A garden is latched, my sister, my bride. The surrounding pool is latched. The spring is sealed. Your plants are an orchard of pomegranates with pleasant fruits. Henna blossoms with spikenard. Spikenard and saffron, reed and cinnamon, with all woods of frankincense, myrrh and aloes, with all tops of aromatics. A spring of gardens, a well of living waters, and streams flowing from Lebanon. Awake, O north wind, and come, you south wind. Blow upon my garden, that the aromatics may flow out. My darling shall come into his garden, and he shall eat his fine fruits. <laughs>